These are the new features for Photoshop 2025. So we have a building with lots of wires. What we can do is go and select the Remove tool. And we have this option up here, Find Distractions. Now conveniently we have wires and cables. Let's select this. And voila, most of them are now gone. And we can just use the Remove tool to clean up anything that's left over. Excellent, nice tall building with no wires. Now with our next image, what we can do is go up to Find Distractions, and this time we can choose People. However, I've tried this multiple times, and unless the person is staring right at the camera, it doesn't seem to work. So instead, I would just use the Remove tool to draw a big old pink splodge over this chap here. Haha, <laughs> get off my hillside. And there we go, he's gone. And instead, what I'm gonna do is now make a nice big selection and use the latest generative fill, which is powered by Firefly Model 3, and instead I'm going to generate a duck. Why? I have no idea. Quackity quack, we have a duck. There we go. We can now click through our ducks, and I quite like this one here, but I'd like a similar duck. So I'm gonna click the three dots and choose Generate Similar. Ooh, excellent, nice tall duck standing proud, very good. So there we go, I'm very happy with my duck. Now let's switch over to our third image. And on this image, we have a chap with a nice ginger beard. Let's go ahead and remove the background. And what we can do is use this go away. And what we can do now is use the new generate background feature. Let's put him in a circus. I, I don't know why. Oh, there we go. Doesn't that just look marvelous? And then what we can do is select the crop tool. Choose generative expand. And again, we're using Firefly model three. So let's expand this out and press return. And there we go, we can choose our three versions and we have our nice ginger bearded chap in a fun circus. And lastly, there is one more feature that is exclusive to the Photoshop beta and you can access this at any point or you can access it from the welcome screen and that is the generative workspace. And this workspace is powered by Firefly so you can search, you can filter or we could type in the description, cat riding a banana. We're going to add a variable as well, so we'll do outdoor and we'll separate these with a comma. So we'll get some versions that are outdoors and some versions that are indoors. Let's go ahead and select generate. Yeah, there we go, we have a cat riding a banana. We have some outdoor versions and some indoor versions. I'm going to select this one here. We get a bunch of info and we can then open this directly in the Photoshop beta. Boom, there we go. That is our cat riding a banana. So those are the new updates for Photoshop 2025. And if you'd like to master Photoshop, you can check out my course at dansky.com.